Hi there, Chris Fox here. Still working on this, uh, this Cummins engine for Halton County. And uh, what I've done is I've uh, flipped it over. And we're going to take the crankshaft out. So we're getting ready to do that. Got all, all the uh, mains loose. It's fine. Still have to pull the rear oil seal. Rear cover here. Uh, but right now what we're doing is I'm tracking and I'm taking the front cover off. Okay, so what we've done is we've taken the crankshaft pulley off, camshaft, retainer, the uh, auxiliary gear retainer here, the blower drive, and that's the oil. The, the oil pumps up here and that's the, that's the fuel pump drive. And the water pump goes in there. So we're just going to pull this off now. You'll be able to see the gears. Hopefully uh, it'll come off fairly straightforward. This is doweled to the front of the engine. So you gotta be real careful. Let's take it apart. There you go. This is your crankshaft and your idler and your camshaft and your oil pump. And the blower drive goes in here and this is your fuel pump. all the seals in there yeah so all you do is you pull the pull a crankshaft to change the bearings you undo these pull the rear seal and then you take all of them out and then you just lift it up timing marks will be right in here and I'll see if I can find them and then show you all right, so that's the gear train. And that's what it looks like when it's turning. Okay. So set the timing mark. So there's a timing mark right here. There's a zero right there. So realistically, if I can get on this, I should be able to find the timing mark on the camshaft. It's pretty weird that you can't see it. Zero there, there should be another zero or two dots. I can't find it, and I want to find that before I pull anything. The mark here. There's a mark 
here, but it's not the right. Remember the crankshaft turns once, the camshaft turns twice. So if you can't find the mark on the one side, crank it around and you should be able to find it on the other. There it is. All right. So now that we know where the, what marks are what, you look right there, right here. You can see there's a zero here on the crankshaft. And there's a big fat zero there on the camshaft. And that's where the timing marks have to line up like that. So once we have that done, then we can pull, <coughs> we can pull the crankshaft. And uh, yeah, change the bearings. All right. Thanks for watching.